I say, I say, this is for my Frankie. Frankie, I look for you every day. I find myself kneeling and praying and wishing and saying that I can see you behind that tree. Frankie, baby, all I ever do and all I ever do and say is, will you come home to me? As the crazy witch in stride, losing herself amongst the trees. Son, you just come home to me. I want another day with him. I wish to rewind the time that was spent and and bottle it up. I want to bottle it up so I can hold on a little longer. I want to feel his presence beside me to hear him laughing. Well, that would bring me such joy, his contagious smile. Well, it could light up every damn street light. You people just didn't know he had that way about him. He always was mischievously searching for a way to bring happiness to your day. The laughter that we shared, well, it was my favorite sound. It was that comfortable way. It was a comfortable way that we had. No time had ever seemed to pass. We could <laughs> we could go months without seeing each other. Then it's as if my boys, well, they would come home. That's what he was to me. He was my home. He was my family. He was my Frankie. So full of wonder and awe at everything he would see. He would, he always questioned things. Those things that would make my mind ponder words to inspire him. He brought me the gifts to see with different eyes. My friends, he had those childlike eyes. No matter how much he had grown, I would wrap my arms around him in the strongest mother's embrace. The first thing I'd say is, have you been hating yourself? <laughs> People, his smile and laugh, as I said, it was contagious. The way he always made, he made me feel. He made me feel that his aunt crazy. Well, I wasn't a babbling brook of nonsense. <laughs> we would speak of everything, everything, a revolution of that kid. Well, it brings me to my knees. The moments with him, there's so many and so far in between. They are my greatest blessings. I have so much more to say about that kid, but as my tears fall from these eyes, I have to put my words away for now. Because, well, the pain of it all, well, it keeps sneaking up on me and rewinds me back in. But just know, I have so many more chapters to go about him. And people, every day, I just try to begin.